I'm from. Finger on the pump, make the six tray jump from SoCal. Hollywood to the slums, chronic smoke. Yeah. So we asked all of your 10th grade teachers what comes to mind when they think of L.A. I think of Santa Monica and beaches and beach volleyball and the Hollywood sign. I think about lots of people, ocean, and concrete. When I think of Los Angeles, I think of the diversity of people. I think of the Hollywood sign. I think of the unfair school systems. And I think of sitting on the 405 and all the other freeways that are connected and look like spider webs. When I think of Los Angeles, I think of freeways, mountains, and beaches. Dodgers. Quinoa. <laughs> Go Lakers. Hollywood. Film industry. Diversity of people. Automotive industry. Los Angeles has a bad rap. And we just don't mean Snoop Dogg when we say that. With a constant influx of human migration, mega drought, thousands of miles of freeways, and the resulting impact on the ecosystem, it can be easy to dismiss Los Angeles' future as a foregone conclusion. However, as teachers in Los Angeles, we believe that our students can positively impact and be the solutions needed in order for Los Angeles to thrive. There are many, many ways to answer the question of what does Los Angeles need to thrive? Why are we doing this project? We're doing this project because when I pick this turnip, I feel a connection with the turnip from the plant that I'm holding to the seed that it was planted by. Yeah. When I throw this bottle in the recycling, I think about the bottle ending up in the recycling instead of ending up in the oceans or on the street. And then there's us, people. We can positively impact the space or negatively impact it. My family came here from Guatemala about 35 years ago. They worked hard and now I'm a teacher. We're doing this because although I only came here three years ago, I still feel equally responsible and connected to the place and to the people and to you. It's really about the choices that we make. I choose to drive a car, but hey, I carpool sometimes. Miss Gross? I ride a bicycle, but I'm lucky enough to just live two miles away from school. Look, straight up, we're doing this intercession project because we love LA and we think that the solution and the way to make LA better and to make it thrive is to have you as students go out and make those changes, those positive impacts that we've hopefully taught you at this point. Um, we think we as teachers are solutions, but more importantly, we think you as students are the solution and are what's gonna make LA thrive. In bio, you'll be learning about biodiversity, which is habitat and species variability, why it's important. You'll also be making predictions about what will happen to populations in the future. In Green Ambassadors, you're going to be learning about human impact on the space of Los Angeles and the organisms that live there. You'll also be, be creating solutions. In math, you'll be analyzing data and making predictions based on the data. In English, you'll be learning from past advocates how to become current agents of change. In history and Spanish, you'll be learning about the different humans that have come into Los Angeles and their impact on each other. Um, and in college prep, you'll be learning, learning about industrial changes, trends, and researching sustainable careers. For the CPT, you're going to be working 
in small groups within your class. You'll also be traveling to all your classes with that same class. And you'll be working to create a museum for the community to visit. The museum will demonstrate how biotic, living, and abiotic, non-living factors are interconnected within Los Angeles. We will also focus on how humans have changed the ecosystem both positively and negatively. Your museum will contain the following. Day in the life of an individual organism, visual representation of human impact, a research study proposal, a sustainable career profile, an advocacy piece, a gigantic Los Angeles historical map, and a timeline. There will be three guiding questions, so you need to figure out the answers to these three questions in order to answer the IUE, that is the interdisciplinary unit exam. Question one, how has human impact on the ecosystem affected biodiversity? Question two, how does biodiversity affect humans? And lastly, what can humans do to help LA thrive in the future? Your response will include areas of advocacy, celebrating cultural diversity, environmental justice, and career choices. Additionally, you'll have a math section where, where you'll have to extrapolate some probability data based on um, a scenario given to you by Ms. Johnson. Yay!